Hey guys, how are you doing today? I hope you're having a good time as much as you can in the isolation situation, as we call it. And as I'm in the same situation like many of you, uh, you know, I'm trying to do the most of it. And I'm trying to take the most of this time to to try new things. And today, the reason why I'm inside when the weather is fantastic outside at the moment, uh, and I'm probably gonna go out to join my kids soon uh, for a cup of coffee or have a little play. But before that, I wanted to talk to you about lighting, budget lighting. Yes, that's the primary subject of this video. Many of you probably wants to start with the photography or already start or looking for solution not to spend so much money because of the situation at the moment uh, I do understand and uh, trust me I'm affected as well there's no many jobs going on pretty much nothing going on to be honest and the uh, situation and the, the, the thinking of spending money to invest in something just to keep you going it's a little bit uh, scary but don't worry about it because I have some solution for you I want to show you three lights which I'm using uh, for my photography and all of them it's up to the mark of uh, 100 to 150 pounds okay starting from 50 pound to 150 pound I know 150 may sound too much in uh, some budget scenarios but of course you want to get at least some quality and not just looking over the price so first of all the cheapest one it's just here these soft boxes and one behind me they call ESDDI or SD or I don't have a clue seriously how exactly it's called a company name but uh, them too it's coming as a pair so you can buy them and uh, they come as a pair of lighting, fantastic, for a price, I think I bought them around 50 to 59 pounds. I will leave a link in the description, uh, probably for Amazon to check. Sometimes they run offers and I remember I bought them on offer under 50 pounds. It was around 48 pounds or something like this for both of them, which is absolutely fantastic price. Okay, what you have in here, it's 60 by 60 centimeter soft box let me just show you inside so inside let me just take it I will take it down no no I won't actually I'll leave it here and I'll just turn it to you so as you can see inside you have a LED bulb let's take it out this is what you got I got a round light bulb which is absolutely fantastic it's 50 watt and a 5400k yeah so it's very bright very white uh, now the pros of this let me just show you when they come they're basically very easy to assemble because that's what they happening they come straight away with the umbrella it's already system which you just push it's open the light, then you put your LED bulb inside. You have the diffuser, it's on uh, four Velcros. It pretty much is just put around the frame. It's stuck with a Velcro in the middle and you're good to go. And there you go, when you switch it on, fantastic bright light. Now I will switch it off because it's getting too bright. The good thing of this lighting is they come in pair of two. So if you shoot something uh, like a still photography, you can have them basically on both sides or maybe one on the top, whatever you decide. But the downsides of them is they're not big color lights, so they don't change the temperature. So they're one set temperature and the other downside of them is they're not dimmable. Okay, so you need to play with your camera setting to find the best... Uh, settings to take the pictures i do use them for my youtube videos for my other channel which i make cocktails and i use them as well for my photography for my instagram to shoot my cocktails pictures and 
If you visit my Instagram, just shake or steer, you'll see I have tons of pictures there and pretty much the last few months all the pictures it's taken lighting just with these lights. And it's working fantastic. Okay, it's not like the speed light and you don't have the full control of the lighting because it's not dimmable and it's not big color, but still you can uh, use your camera setting and then in post-processing you can adjust some things. However, for the price of 50 pound, I think that's fantastic investment and it's a good way to get you started. Okay, you get them both. I don't remember if they came with the stunts. I think they just, I think they came with the stunts actually. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, they came with the stunts. I'm pretty sure they came with the stunts. So it's a good price. The next light which I want to show you, this is them LED panels, newer. There you go. So you have the newer LED panel. I probably should get one with the batteries. Uh, just a second. Let me grab it here. So newers, they have few models. This is the NL480. The reason I bought this one because they have digital display on the back. Now these lights, you can buy a single one or you can buy a pair as well. Uh, the price is uh, over hundred pound, but of course you're getting so much more control over your lighting with them. So you pay a little bit more for all these extras. First of all, it's aluminum body. It's fantastic. Uh, you have on the back your controls on the front. They both come in a nice lovely soft cases. I can't show you the cases because at the moment they're in my studio and I've not been there for a while, which I probably should go and check what's happening. But yes, they come in nice carry bags, really exactly the same size like the lights, just to put the light inside and the AC charger. Now, what is the good, what is the bad? I don't think it's any bad about them, okay? People may say, yeah, cheap lights, uh, they can be that good, but yes, they are good. And uh, I, in my situation, taking a picture, so shooting a, just a simple videos of cocktail videos or even video like that, uh, they are absolutely fantastic. So, you have barn doors, which is beautiful because you can obviously control your lights and direction and everything. Also, these barn doors, they're removable. So, it's just four screws and you can easily remove them and take them out and don't use barn doors. Also, they come inside, as you can see, they have the diffuser. Now, the diffuser is very easy, it's just on two flips you push them down and you can just basically take out the diffuser yeah just slide it out now it's a little bit hard with the barn doors but yeah so you can slide it out and then you have it the good things with that also it's uh, when when you put the diffuser you just flip the switches up on the side and the diffuser is gonna be locked okay and it's not gonna go anywhere so if I switch them on, now this is what you have. At the moment it's on 16%, so here we go. I can turn it up to 100, go down to zero. The good things with them lights is because, first of all, you have on the back, you have your LCD display, which is showing you exactly how much percentage you're putting on the actual up and down level when you dim and also you can change the temperature from here that it's a brilliant also you have the AC input because they come with the AC input so you can plug them all the time or you can use one or two batteries which is fantastic if you go on the remote location and you don't have where to plug the switch it's double so when you plug uh, to AC power you use number one when you plug to a battery use number two as you can see they go from let me just show you see if you can see it maybe i need to remove the reflector yeah so that's the warm as you can see you have warm or you can change and go completely on cold lights so it's changing from 5600K 
going down to 3200k okay so this is brilliant because i love these lights they're they're not heavy at all see they're very slim having a uh, nice two carry cases with them uh, you can just put them even in your backpack easy to transport obviously coming with the bracket so you can adjust the angle and everything and the best things of them I like it's because I can change the temperature so I don't need to play too much with my camera I can see everything on the LCD screen so I can adjust my white balance on the camera if I want too much and obviously I can dim them from 0 to 100 percent they don't have remote control but come on for this price for all the options which you get in this aluminium body it's absolutely fantastic so this is the model NL480 I will leave description uh, in the description some links as well and finally I wanted to show you the one which I'm shooting at the moment so this is what we have here we have the Godox SL 60 watt as you can see on the back you just move it as you can see on the back you have LCD screen you have the temperature you have uh, the dim percentage you also can change channels because if you use few of them obviously you can uh, assign them to different channels because they come with this remote control so here we go if i get the remote control on i can change the temperature i can change the dim i can change the channels from the remote control it's not gonna focus isn't it because it's focused on my face anyway that's the remote control so as you can see at the moment it's gone down the lighting if i keep pressing the plus it's gonna go up it's fantastic also they are coming with a grid and with a reflector so you have the reflector and it's coming with a three different grids coming with a 50 degree and then you have just so you have 30 degree grid you have 10 degree grid and you have the 51 which it's at the moment on the light this one it's cost uh, around 100 pound for a single unit and it's coming just the unit without any stands without anything but it's a brilliant light and um, if you want to have more control over your photography with a small reflector or with a cone or with a big uh, softbox this one is fantastic obviously it's only one cost around 100 pounds so you have to invest more if you want to get two of them but starting with one still absolutely fine because as you can see where i shoot down there this is my uh kind of a backdrop and area when i shoot my cocktails i use this one sometime in the front lighting or from the top and also sometime i use on the side but i use one of those a foam board okay just to if i have the light here i can reflect to this foam board and bring some lights back to the cocktails which i should so as you can see guys this is uh, three options you can have the 50 pound the newer which it's single one i think it's around uh, 60 or 70 pound or you can buy both and when you buy them both as a package it's cheaper i'll leave the description in the description link uh, because when i bought them i think i bought them around 120 quid something like that uh, but that was a long time ago they maybe dropped down maybe have a new model i don't know I'm, i didn't check because since i got these lights i've been absolutely happy with them and i don't even want to change them uh, i've made so many pictures in my studio with them portrait pictures with one lighting on the side just for a nice reflection on the face and uh, make some nice sculptured lights and it's brilliant for that job and finally you have the godox which it's uh, kind of a level up and uh, obviously the most expensive in this case because it's just for a single unit but as you can see you have many options to start with and uh, there's no reason not to try even if you get this the cheapest one trust me they will be with you for a long time because you can change the bulb you can uh, 
obviously put them down if you don't use them or you can keep using them pretty much forever as a filling lights or as a key light anything even if you do video or you just need to feel a little bit of lighting in your uh, composition they're beautiful because you can just move them close or far from your composition and you get uh, the level which you want of course you gotta play with your camera with them because they they're not big color they're not uh, dimmable that's that's what it is for this price my name is george guys i hope you enjoy this video and if you have any questions uh, just fire up uh, until then you can check my instagram as i say just shake or steer i will leave a link in the description uh, or i'll put a cart yeah, I'll leave, I'll leave anywhere, I'll leave all the links down so you can see what's happening with this lighting and what photography I take with them. Uh, until then, like and subscribe and uh, I'll see you in the next video. For now, bye bye. Okay. That's still recording. Nice. Uh, let's stop this baby. Lovely.